Tesla Cybertruck is getting another big update. No, this time it's not the new wheels or bigger windshield wipers. Elon Musk has confirmed this, and no one is going to get the cheapest version of the Cybertruck anymore. Bye bye 40k electric truck. On the upside, Elon has given us hope we were all waiting for. Here is what happened. At Tesla's annual shareholders meeting, Elon Musk stated that a lot had happened since the Cybertruck had been unveiled in 2019. Tesla planned to begin the production on the Cybertruck in late 2021. However, this had been pushed back to late 2022. Following the reports that the Cybertruck might be delayed again, Elon Musk clarified that Tesla would not introduce any vehicles until the end of 2022. That means the Cybertruck won't arrive until 2023. The first delays were blamed on supply chain concerns, which have been plaguing the entire automobile sector. Elon Musk said that Tesla simply could not produce enough 4680 battery cells for the Cybertruck and that the steel frame would need the development of an entirely new casting process. Meanwhile, Tesla has been forthright about its goals, stating that it would not commence Cybertruck manufacturing until the Texas Gigafactory production on the new Model Y. This just began in March of 2022. Still, it now allows Tesla to prepare for Cybertruck manufacturing. Elon Musk has also said that Tesla intends to finish Cybertruck development by the end of 2022, with production beginning in 2023. He subsequently explained that the Cybertruck would arrive in 2023 and in July 2022 affirmed that the truck would be in production by mid-2023. If there are no unexpected delays, the Cybertruck might be on the road shortly. The most significant part of Musk's update is that the specifications and pricing of the Cybertruck will be changed, noting inflation and other challenges that had arisen in the three years since the electric truck was initially presented. I hate to break the terrible news, he said before praising the Cybertruck as one hell of a product and a damn good machine. The Cybertruck was initially planned to start at the meager price of $39,900. Musk did not provide any information that the initial pricing would not be the same. He claims the firm has so many orders that it might take three years to process them. The number of bookings remains one unsolved issue Tesla has on its file. The most recent figure recorded 650,000 and it was from June of 2020 although it's expected that it had increased since then. According to Electric, a crowdsourced Cybertruck reservation count by the Cybertruck Forum with over 28,000 posts projected bookings at over 1 million in May 2021. The number of bookings has increased over the previous year and is currently projected to be close to 1.5 million. Meanwhile, rivals like Ford and Rivian have introduced their own electric pickups claiming that Ford expects to produce 150,000 F-150 Lightnings by 2023. Tesla said in 2019 that it would make three variants of the Cybertruck. For $38,900, you would get a single-motor rear-wheel drive with the range of 250 miles, a towing capability of 7,500 pounds, and a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of fewer than 6.5 seconds. For $49,900, you could get dual motor all-wheel drive with 300 miles of range, a towing capability of 10,000 pounds, and a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of fewer than 4.5 seconds. And for $69,900, you get a triple motor all-wheel drive with 500 miles of range, a 14,000 pound towing capability, and a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of less than 2.9 seconds. Although, we are not sure if Tesla is still planning to produce those three models. However, according to some speculations, a smaller truck version may be presented. Still, it's unclear if it would vary from the original Cybertruck model. The proportions of the Tesla Cybertruck may change between now and its formal debut. Still, based on what we know, it will be. 231.7 inches long, 75 inches tall, and 79.8 inches wide. Those dimensions are around the same size as the F-150 Lightning. 
This Sabbat rock with its adjustable air suspension seems capable of approach and departure angles of 35 to 28 degrees, and it has 16 inches of ground clearance. It can transport weights of up to 3,500 pounds because of a 6.5-foot bed. If these figures are correct, it will be a very competent electric pickup. The size of the batteries that will power Tesla's electric truck has not been revealed. Every model, however, will have a 250 kilowatt charging cable. Of course, it will have access to Tesla's huge network of superchargers. The number of motors determines the driving range. However, Tesla states that the single engine has a range of 250 plus miles, dual motors will have a range of 300 plus miles, and the top tier tri motor system will have the range of more than 500 miles on a single charge. The Sabatrox wedge-shaped style and origami stainless steel structure are perhaps the most stunning aspects of the vehicle. It only illustrates Musk's insatiable desire to surprise the automobile industry and flip automotive traditions on their heads. Elon Musk claimed in June of 2022 that the Tesla Sabatrox exterior design was finally secured. Still, we haven't seen much indication of significantly changing the wedge form. According to industry analysts, the angular design created significant concerns about pedestrian safety in late 2019. One has to presume that since then, Tesla has toned down the design and that it was obliged to install regular side mirrors to comply with legal requirements. The basic form we've seen is still somewhat intimidating, though not especially appealing. The industry has welcomed regular-looking EVs more quickly in the years since the Tesla Sabatrock was initially unveiled. Still, the Sabatrock seems to be an alien from another time. Expect in-bed storage, detachable wing mirrors, and ultra-slim LDEs in the front. At the same time, the armored glass promises excellent damage tolerance, as long as you don't hurl a steel ball at it. Because the body is allegedly stainless steel, you may be able to get one without the paint. The colors of the Tesla Sabatrock are unknown at this time. However, the company doesn't provide crazy color palettes and will most likely adhere to the plain blacks, whites, and grays shown on its previous models. Tesla had some excellent news when it was discovered that, if implemented, the new climate pact proposed by Senate Democrats would erase the ceiling of 200,000 cars sold to trigger a phase-out of the $7,500 tax credit. Tesla was the first car maker to sell 200,000 electric vehicles, beginning the phase-out back in 2018. However, the law would limit credit eligibility to EVs priced at no more than $55,000 for new cars and $80,000 for trucks and SUVs, which means Tesla will need to price the electric Cybertruck correctly for it to qualify for the credit. For the time being, Musk has only said that the installation of equipment and tooling for Cybertruck manufacturing would commence in the coming months. Last year, Tesla pulled the specifications and price information for the three planned Cybertruck variants from its website. Elon Musk dodged the question of how much the Cybertruck would cost when it finally reaches the road next year. He also avoided questions regarding the deteriorating U.S.-China relationships, which is not unexpected given that China is a crucial supply, manufacture, and sales hub for Tesla vehicles. The Sabatruck was also intended to visit the UK. On the other hand, Musk said that the truck is presently being manufactured to US specifications, since making it fit for every nation would be unfeasible. Pricing and launch specifics for the UK are currently unclear. Given the product's rocky past, Musk's boasts regarding the highly anticipated EV truck are challenging to take in now. However, with the present state of market inflation, global supply chain challenges, and manufacturing issues at the Austin and Berlin Gigafactories, it's difficult to estimate how all of this will affect Sabatruck's ultimate pricing. Musk stated in a tweet that the Tesla pickup truck had been inspired by the Lotus Esprit from the James Bond film series. Although that wasn't the first time he mentioned this chunk of Jajaro designed wedge, those who thought the Tesla Model 3 interior was sparse would have the same impression when they view the Sabatrox light interior. 
Many basic features and choices are yet to be revealed. The initial pictures, however, show a slab black dashboard dominated by a single huge touchscreen. Its squared off steering wheel seems to include an illuminated display, although this is yet to be verified. The Sabatrock can also seat up to six passengers and has a 6.4 foot cargo bed with a capacity of 100 cubic feet. It also boasts a clever slide out tailgate that serves as a ramp for loading four wheelers and motorbikes. The Tesla Cybertruck is undoubtedly the most unique looking vehicle to hit the road in decades. Minimalist style, some of the most incredible range on the market, and all the technological features you could dream of. In other words, this may be an electric vehicle to keep an eye on, even if you ignore the aesthetics. If you would like to know more about Tesla news and updates, please check out these two videos on your screen. Thanks for watching and see you in the next videos.